Cloud. I know you loving the sound. Look at me now. Oh, oh what a glorious day. Thank you, stock gods, for our daily bread. Oh, we getting rich. We getting rich, all right. Did you buy the dip? Did you thank the Stock gods for your daily bread. 4.74% up in America. 8.55% in Canada. <laughs> what a glorious day. Oh my goodness. And we're live to talk about it. Give me your picks. I want your picks. We're the only place in the universe that's going to give you the picks and the hits. It's true. We got our own hits. We got the picks. And we bring them to you first. And it was a glorious day. Oh, what a glorious day. Yes, you thought all oh, rich wasn't going to gloat. Oh, I'm going to gloat. I'm gloating. I'm gloating. I'm not I'm going to I'm going to gloat. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to gloat a little bit. It's the time to gloat. Cuz why not? When everything in the market is green, you think we're not going to celebrate? Like, are you kidding? You know your boy is going to celebrate, man. You know your boy's going to come at you with the winners, man. What do you mean? Oh, my goodness. I'm excited right now. Like, I don't know if you got... Where's all the haters today? Where's all the namast haters today? Step up right now. If you've been a namast basher, where you at? In fact, I got a song for you. Bashers and haters. Thanks to Ill Kid for making these songs possible. Ill Kid makes these songs possible. It's true. The mask up 30%. What? Where are the trolls at, man? I don't see them anywhere today. Damn. Golden Leaf Holdings up 25%. What? What? Oganogram up 17%. What? I said what? Yo, what's up, party people? Happy New Year. Rich gang, rich gang. We got the winners right here, man. H E X O up ten percent. Chronos Group up 
the green organic Dutch on fire, up 8%. Canopy growth, LeBron James saying, hey, 2019 is going to be our year. Stepping up to the plate. Just listen to that music. It's running through my veins. Where the trolls at, man? Come at me today. Bring it. I dare you. I want you to. Bring it. All the trolls. We have a song for you guys. <laughs> Woo! Where you at? Where all the shorters at today? Yo, guys, drop all the winners. Drop all the winners. We'll check them out. We're going to look at all the winners. Oh, I have a message. Listen. Disappeared. All the trolls have disappeared. They've run and they've hide. Listen, cannabis growth up 7.63%. Afria up 5.62%. Oxley has been in Fuego on fire at 96 cents now, kissing, almost kissing the dollar. Almost kissing the dollar. Up 5%. And Aurora Cannabis, my number one pick of 2019. Up 4.57%. And did you see my top 10 video? Did you see my top 10 video? I don't know if you guys saw my top 10 video, but all of my top 10 for 2019 were up today. I'm just saying. I'm just making it clear. Look, all my picks, your boy's picks for free. I don't want your money, eh? I want your eyes and I want your ears on the prize. This is the other thing. I got some big news for you guys. So I created another group for analysts today. It's a whole nother WhatsApp group. And a lot of you have been trying to get in my WhatsApp group. So I've created another secret group. If you want to be a part of this group, email me why you should be a part of this group. RichTVLive at gmail.com right here. And I'll try to get you into my secret group. Just like that, man. Like, just like that. You know, great things are happening. It's New Year's, a new year, new day, January 2nd, and bam, the market explodes. You know what the crazy part about this is? There's not even any news. There's no news. <laughs> That's the best part about this. There's no news. And this is happening with no news. <laughs> so we're going to look at the global markets and we're going to talk about it because I think it's pretty interesting what's happening. And I don't know if you guys see what's happening, but to me it's very obvious. That's why I told you guys we're at the bottom. I told you guys we're at the bottom and we're going to find a bottom. And look, the Dow Jones finished up. 18 points. The S&P 500 finished up 3 points. The Nasdaq finished up 30 points. The global Dow down slightly, down 4 points. Gold up 5 points, slowly walking up. And oil climbing back up a little bit, up 1 point, 2.27%. 2 so what do you think is happening in these markets on a global scale? Like, what do you think is happening? Yeah, man, this is the start. Attila did say that the 1st of January is when hemp will be legalized. That is correct. Yo, what's up, Infinite Possibilities? What's up, Pistol Pete? How are you guys doing? How's everybody doing today? If I haven't um, mentioned your name, I apologize. 
Um, I want to give everybody a shout out. Thank you guys, all of you for joining and being here to be a part of this revolution, the cannabis stock revolution. It is a real revolution. And I'm going to bring you all the winners like right now. We're going to look at it. So, you know, I even have love for the trolls because without you guys, I wouldn't have like Superman needs a Dr. Evil, right? So it's okay. It's okay. Superman needs a Dr. Evil. Yo, what's up, Lucas from the T-Dot? Respect from my homeland. I told you guys, why does God love the Toronto Maple Leafs? Because the, the sky is blue and white, right? That's why the sky is blue and white. Because Toronto, you know, God is a Maple Leafs fan. And the Leafs wear blue and white. And the sky is blue and white. So, that's why we're blessed. That's why we're blessed. It's true. <laughs> We're going to take a look, and yeah, I'm in a good mood. You can tell. I'm in a very good mood, and I am ready to celebrate in 2019. I am ready to make 2019 our biggest and our best year ever. I believe the top 10 that I gave you guys, which is absolutely free, right before the holidays here, was like a gift from, you know, a rich God, you know, a semi-rich God. And I just wanted to do that because I thought it was... The right thing to do. And it's funny because all of those companies were up today. But they're not the only companies that were up today. Almost all, that's right, almost all of the cannabis stocks were in the green today. Let's talk about it. Buds. Unbelievable day for buds. Look at this. Are you kidding me? Up 56% symbol weed in America. You couldn't get a better symbol in America. That is what the symbol is for cannabis growth in Canada. Funny enough. But the symbol for weed in America is actually buds. B-U-D-Z. And it was a 56% today. That was a serious move. Now, this company here, IGCC, they have been... The most crazy, one of the most craziest stocks to watch, and they had a crazy 2018 all the way up, like over 10 bucks, right? And now they crashed all the way down, and look at this today coming off a of bottom. Very volatile company, very risky, but up 53 percent. Wow, unbelievable, absolutely unbelievable. And let's take a look at some more HSGX up 38 percent at 12 cents. Matika Enterprises, a penny stock that I've been watching very carefully. Strong buy, strong buy, strong buy, strong buy, strong buy, strong buy, up 33%. Doing a nice little move. Traded 2.9 million shares. Here's a crypto stock, Block Strain Technologies, up 33% today. So a lot of interesting moves today on the first day back. The first day of trading for 2019. So it's very interesting. Then we move to Namaste. Obviously, everybody's been saying, oh, Rich, you talk about Namaste a lot. You know, what do you think about Namaste? Do you think they're going to go up? Do you think they're going to do well? Yeah, Namaste is a great company. I told you guys. Oh, do you think Namaste is going to be delisted? No. Do you think Namaste will go up over time? Yes. Do you think Namaste was heavily oversold? Yes. Do you think that before they may have been overpriced? Yes. Were most of the cannabis stocks in the entire sector overpriced? Yes. This is why they had to go down in 2018. Now what's happening is they're starting to make more money. And their prices are more justified because they've all come down. So what's happening is as their revenues start to grow again, and these companies are still, you're still looking forward because they're revenue generating companies. They're growing quarter over quarter by like some of them 50 to 200% per quarter. So the revenues are growing exponentially because they're acquiring their growth. If they continue to grow like this, the prices will also grow. And there's going to be examples of this everywhere today that we're going to talk about. Okay. Obviously, Namaste is one of the biggest ones that we've been talking about a lot. And a lot of people have been saying, Rich, they're down, Rich, they're down, bam, up 30% today. So if you got in at that bottom, you could have sold today and made a great return on your investment. PREV, another stock down 
Big recently had a monster day up 30% at six cents. Strong buy, strong buy, strong buy, strong buy. So lots of power in the market today. Quadrin Canatech at 14 cents up 27% today. So look at all the monsters that had big days today. I already talked to you guys about Golden Leaf Holdings. Strong buy, strong buy, strong buy, strong buy, strong buy, strong buy. Look at the momentum. Look at the big mo. This is all about momentum, people. You know, you really have to, need to understand momentum. Here's one that was trading way higher. I mean, this was trading at $20 at one point. They're at three bucks right now. Beast. Totally oversold. Up 25% today. Unbelievable. Zynarba Pharma. These stocks are hitting a bottom. There's no news. They just hit a bottom. Kylie Terra Therapeutics up 25% at seven and a half cents. Blockchain Foundry at two and a half cents up 25%. Nutritional High International Inc. at 33 cents up 24%. Like, look at all these strong buys everywhere. Like, what a day in the markets. INSY up 24%. Strong buys everywhere. A strong sell on the daily. Interesting, but up 24%. A Agra Flora Organics, AGRA. Doing the sneak attack up 23%. Look at all the strong buys. Like so many winners today, man. So many winners today. Sing, penny stock, 21% up. Everybody wanting to start the new year on the right foot in the cannabis sector. Was this planned? Because I didn't get the memo, but I'm happy to be a part of it. You know what I mean? I mean, if you didn't get the memo, then at least you're watching Rich TV Live and we're going to bring you guys the news, right? We're going to bring you guys the news. We're going to bring you guys the information. As it happens, 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Yes, I did sell. I always sell in the green. And I'm always buying in the red. You know, and I told myself, I don't really want to talk about my trades because I feel like I have so many shorters watching. And they're going to try to short everything I talk about. So I'm just going to talk about everything all the time. But I'm going to really try to talk less about what I'm trading on my streams because I just feel like the shorters are attacking me. You know, I do. I honestly do feel like you guys are attacking me. And yes, I feel special. But, you know, I don't know if it's the smartest thing for my trading to have everybody in the world know what I'm buying all the time. Especially when I'm buying and selling all the time. So when you see the market is red like this, you already know your boy is selling. <laughs> and when the market is beaten down red, you know your boy was buying. Right? So, I mean, that's just what it is. So this is a cannabis stock resurrection. That's what it is. It's a cannabis stock resurrection. And we have a song for this. And it is a resurrection of epic proportions. And we're going to continue to follow the markets. We will continue to do it. I promise you. I promise you. We will continue to follow the markets. And we will be the first to bring you all the news. 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. And we have a song for the cannabis stock resurrection. Because I believe we predicted this. I believe I predicted this. Pretty sure I predicted this. Cannabis stock resurrection. We even have a song for it. Let's see. You know, like, let's 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 go to that song. Pretty sure I can go to that song. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You gotta hear you, Rich. You gotta hear you, Rich. Hold on. I want you guys to hear this. I think I predicted this. Pretty sure I predicted it. This. Yo, Suniva had a day today. 19% move for Suniva. Wow. 
strong buy, strong buy, strong buy, strong buy. Didn't I predict this? Didn't I predict this? I mean, we could. Yeah. Sure, just can't take us down. It's the time to buy. <laughs> we are the leader for the legalized. OGI had a monster day today, Nika. Monster day. Today's the day to celebrate. Look at all the winners. OGI. One of the original OGs. I brought this to you when it was at a dollar. Now at $5.67, it's still cheap. Up 17%. Wow. What a move. People wonder why we invest in cannabis stocks. I don't know. Why don't you look at the numbers? Numbers don't lie, but people do, eh? Oh, and one of my top five. This is where my top ten come in. Men, men. I believe I had him listed number three on my top ten. I think they were number three. Up 16%. The first day, number three. The very first day. Of trading in 2019, your boy told you Medman was in the top 10 picks of 2019. I believe they were number three on my list. I gave you guys that list for free. I didn't charge you for that, eh? Last time I looked. And drop. Life science is up 16%. Eve and Co. Up 16%. Look at all those strong bites. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Yo, GBTC, a crypto stock, the best crypto stock to buy at $4.62. Monster Day, up 16%. Predicted all of this, man. <clears throat> it's crazy. Listen. I mean, I, I, I don't know. If this, I just, is that a prediction? I don't know. Did you get a bigger, better, better prediction than that? I mean, I don't know. I mean, like, everything is green. Like, everything I'm looking at is green. Like, everything is green. It's a green machine. Look at crop infrastructure up 15% at $0.34. Cents. Like, I'm going crazy right now. Like, everything is green. Like, target capital. I don't even know what it is. It's up 14%. It's on my watch list. Delta 9 Cannabis. Love these guys. Look at the move on these guys. Look at that chart. Are you kidding me? Strong buy. Strong buy. Strong buy. Strong buy. Up 13.93%. Delta 9 Cannabis. Interspace Diagnostics. That's a tongue twister. Say that five times. Up 13.75% and 91 cents. SOL. This company... Oh my goodness, they were at a dollar. They're at 255. These are the guys that got called out. These are the guys that got called out on the scandal by the short sellers with Afria. Look at the move they are making. Are you kidding me? They have come from a dollar to 255. Wow. Wow. Take your profits when you see them. People are like, Rich, when do you take your profits? When I see 10% or more, I take it. Oh, a big day for Juju. Christine, if you are watching, 
a big day for Juju. Huge day for Juju. If you are watching today, Christine, congratulations. I know she's been very, very upset with them. Amira Natural Foods, 13.29%. Inmed Pharma, a company that's been beat up like crazy at 38 and a half cents. I love this company, but it's been getting destroyed up 13%. CUV Ventures up 12.96%. Supreme Cannabis Fire finally having a day up 12.88%. Lots of winners today. My goodness, we could be here all day just on winners. This is just in my watch list, TRTC up 12.79%. Like everything is green. CPTR, Captor Capital. 12.8%. Unbelievable. It's really quite unbelievable. I mean, we need some special music for this. I, like, I feel like in a celebration mood, we created a song for people not to panic. Maybe this song will make you guys understand why you buy in the red and you sell in the green. What else? So much green. What else? Network exploration up 12%. G-Tech Holdings up 12%. Breathe Tech Biomedical up 12%. Albatus. Up 12%. Corbis Pharmaceutical Holdings up 12%. Everything is up, guys. Hexo. Beast. Up 11%. I should have put them in my top 10. They are really good. They were, they were close to being in the top 10. Meta. National Access Cannabis up 11%. LGC Capital up 11%. Inner Spirit. Up 11%. Everything is up. MCIG. Up 10%. New Strike Brands. Finally coming from the dead. Up 10%. New Strike Brands. One of the most... Undervalued cannabis stocks in the sector, in my opinion. Harvest One Cannabis, another one that's been beaten up, up 10%. It's a day for the pennies. Copin, KOPN, up 10%. GTX, up 10, 9.9%. James E. Wagner has been making a sneak attack, up 9.70%. They have been on fire, people. Emerald Health up 9.54%. Rocky Mountain High Brands, a penny stock, up 9%. David's Tea up 9%. Round and round we go. Don't panic. Don't panic. <laughs> oh my goodness. Cannabix Pharma. Up 8.97%. Merry Men. Are you it's like, is it Christmas? Is this an early Christmas? Merry Men up 8.92%. Raven Quest Biomed up 8.89%. Chronos Group up. 8.85%. I mean, the list goes on and on and on. It's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. ICAN, I-C-A-N, Integrated Cannabis, up 8.82%. 1933 Industries, a company I love. I talked about them a lot. TGIF, at 37 cents, but making millions. Love these guys. Up 8.82%. Emblem. Emblem, kissing a dollar, just kissing a dollar, 8.79%. Micron Waste, up 8.77%.
Planet 13, one that I've talked about a lot in 2018, one that I believe will be a beast in 2019, up 8.72%. Wow. Unbelievable. So many winners. Wow. This is crazy. This is pretty crazy. It's pretty crazy, guys. Medical marijuana, up 8.7%. Neptune Wellness Solutions, up 8.67%. I haven't seen one short seller. Are there any short sellers out there today? Therapix Biosciences up 8.62%. Green Grow Tech up 8.75%. Tetro Biopharma up 8.58%. Green Organic Dutchman. How I love these so much at these prices. Lower than the IPO, I've been telling you guys, was a screaming buy up 8.54%. Pain Therapeutics up 8.53%. Direct View, Penny Stock, the DIRV up 8.35%. Enviro Services, another Penny Stock up 8%. Compugin up 8.29%. Village Farms International at these prices is a screaming buy still at $4.78. This is a beast, people. Up 8%. Radiant Technologies, up 8%. These are all bouncing from a bottom. Naturally Splendid, up 8%. They were oversold. China Jojo Drug Stores, up 8%. Everything is green. Isodial, up 7%. Patriot One Technologies, up 7%. Cantrust, TRST, one that I love. This is a beast. Easily will go to $10. Breathe on it, it goes to $10, up 7%. In Diva at $0.42, cents, up 7%. Like, <laughs> Hempco Food and Fiber, love this company. A hemp company, guys, in Canada, up 7.62%. They have a big ownership position owned by Aurora. Standard Lithium, a lithium company, up 7%. Hive blockchain, overly beaten up in 2018, up 7%. So do you guys see how everything is green? And there he is, LeBron James. There he is, LeBron James, the leader of the cannabis sector in Canada. Weed in Canada, $39.35, up 7.48%. Canopy Growth Corp, otherwise known as... LeBron James, the leader of the cannabis sector. Now, everybody says, Rich, why isn't cannabis number one on your list, Rich? I really am focused on the stocks right now that are under $10. I feel like anything that's over $10 right now, it's just very volatile. And the market needs to play itself out until these companies start making more revenue. And I just don't believe that they are justified in these prices. I believe that Aurora, Afria, Cantrust, all these companies that we've been talking about here are justified in their prices right now. And I believe they are going to climb. Now, does that mean that they're not going to come back down? Yeah, they will come back down. This market is very volatile. That's what makes it so exciting for investors. Both long investors and short investors can make a lot of money in this marketplace because it goes up very quickly and it goes down very quickly. Okay? And if you play your cards right and you stay in a cash position and you ride the momentum, you can make a lot of money. And if you buy in the red and you sell in the green, which is the rich system, and if you ride momentum, looking at all the indicators and the tools that we use every day, absolutely free, that I show you how to use every day for free, you too can learn how to ride momentum and you too can learn how to have tools that can help you win in the markets. Now, I don't only buy cannabis stocks, but the reality is they are more vibrant than everything else. Like if you look at the markets, you'll see I look at other stocks. In this portfolio, I have everything. Even the big board companies are in this portfolio here. So you're going to see that they're just not up as much as the cannabis stocks today. And that's because the cannabis stocks are the best. Honestly, when it comes to liquidity, 
when it comes to news, when it comes to momentum, when it comes to investors. Look at Vivo, company I love. Love these guys, up 7%, right? Oxley, I talk about them all the time. Told you guys they were highly oversold. They've been on fire recently. Oxley, up 6.92%. They're just starting to climb now. They're starting to climb now. It doesn't mean that they're not going to go back down tomorrow. But right now, some of these companies have momentum. I'm going to show you. WeedMD is another one that has massive momentum. It's been climbing, not just today, but it's been climbing up 6.87%. How about FSD Pharma? One that I own, one that I love. FSD Pharma up 6.73%. So DMGI, 6.67%, right? So a lot of companies up today, right? And we're going to continue to look at them. So much green in the sector. Ianthus, one of the companies in my top 10 that I gave to you guys for 2019. Bam, up 6.36% today. A beast, a monster. I love this company. One of my top 10 for 2019. They are primed and ready to explode. Love them. Let's see. What else is green? GB Sciences, GBLX, all the way down to 16 cents. I think it was highly oversold, up 6%. Alliance Growers Corp, up 6.25%. Cureleaf. One of my top 10 for 2019, told you guys they're a beast, told you I love these guys, up 6% today. Look at all those strong buys. What did I tell you guys about Cureleaf? I told you guys. I told you guys. I told you guys. Don't say I didn't tell you guys. All my picks are fire. Don't say they're not fire. We can watch our 2019 picks. I'll watch the video. Don't make me watch the video, eh? If you guys want this video to stay live, smash that like button or I'm going to cancel this video right now because I can show you guys a lot more. Kush Bottles. Oh yeah, another one of my picks in my top 10 for 2019, up 6% today. Pretty interesting. Is there anybody else on YouTube that has a top 10 that has as much success as me already in 2019? In fact, I'll challenge anybody. Is there anybody on YouTube right now that has a top 10 video that they gave you guys for free. Anybody, I want to know, is there anybody in 2019 that has come up with a top 10 video that has better success than me so far in 2019? I want to know. Because this is the second day of 2019. And I want to know if there's anybody else out there who's giving you guys 10 free picks that are all up today on the first trading day of 2019. I mean, we're going to watch it. We're going to have to watch it. Creative Realities up 6%. Horizon Emerging Marijuana Growers, $7.64 up 6%. In Pixin up 5%. I'm losing my voice. There's so many winners. Green Thumb at $11.60. Under 10 bucks would have been the time to buy for me. Starting to get expensive, but I think this bad boy is going to go way higher. Up 5.94%. ETF MG Alternative Harvest, $26.42, up 5.93%. Symbol for that is MJ. MJ. Yo, it's a beast. You guys should look at that one. MJ is a beast. So is HMMJ. So many winners, man. So many winners. Choom, another one that I made money with in 2018. Love these guys at these prices. Just love them. Up 5%. YOLO, Weekend Unlimited, up 5%. Pharmacite Biotech, up 5%. Aurora Cannabis, number one pick of 2019 from your boy Rich. For January 2019, my number one pick, Aurora Cannabis. How I love the... Thank you, Stock Gods, for giving us Aurora Cannabis. This has been the gift that just keeps on giving. This is such a like forgiving stock. Every time you buy it, it just keeps going up. And then it goes down. And then you sell it. You buy it. It goes up. You sell it. It goes down. You buy it again. It goes up. You sell it. I mean, rinse, repeat, rinse, repeat. I mean, that's pretty much all we've ever done, right? So created a song. This song was kind of inspired by Aurora Cannabis. 
Because I feel like this stock is just silly at these prices. And here's another one, Afria. Another stock that's silly at these prices. Up 5%. It's silly at these prices. Just silly. I was telling you guys, it was at the bottom of its chart. And I was telling you Aurora was at the bottom of its chart. And Afria is also in my top 10 for January 2018. Yes, boss. Boss had a day today. I don't even think I can add boss to my list here. So many picks, man. I'm exhausted. I don't know how much longer I can go live. If you guys want me to stay live, smash that like button, man. I'm exhausted going through all the picks. So many picks. Still it. Silly. I don't think I can add boss to this list. No. Wow, boss, up 44%. Woo! Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Feel it? Wow. From 18 cents. Yo. From 18 cents, yo. All the way to 37 cents. Ooh. Finishing up at 34 cents. Boss. Yo, I love boss. What else? What else, peeps? What else, man? You guys want me to stay live? Give me some pics you want me to look at. If there's anything that I need to look at, now is the time. Speak now or forever. Ever wish you did. Seneva. Look at the chart in Seneva. I love this pick, man. I'm going to show you guys something. Let me show you guys something. See how I mark that on the 24th? How I mark the bottom? I literally mark the bottom for you guys. That was $2.81. It's now at $3.91. So I marked this for you guys like a week ago. I told you guys it was the bottom. Unbelievable. That's why I mark these. So when I do these videos, I can show you guys. Look at that move in one week. See, this is what I'm saying to you guys. You want to buy red, sell green, hunt bottoms. Look for good companies that are beaten up, that are undervalued, underappreciated, underexposed. And when they're beat up, you buy them. And then when they go up, you sell them. You know? Like, people are asking me, but what happened with green growth brands today? Like, what kind of question is that? Like, I'm going to answer your question, okay? Because I want to prove to you that it's a stupid question. Because look, what happened to green growth brands today? It's down 1%. So let me mark that for you, wise guy. So what happened today to green growth brands? I don't know. Why don't you tell me what happened? Flights? What happened? It went down 1%. What happened? Like, why are you wasting my time with nonsense? I want to find winners. I want to find momentum. If a stock that's been up, oh, I don't know, 100% in the last month goes down 1%, you're going to call me on it? Really? Really? Come on, man.
Come on, man. This is what I'm trying to say, man. Let's make 2018 a year of the past and let's make 2019 the best year ever by focusing on positive, powerful conversations. You see, even you trolls, we can work together. We could be a team. You take them down, we buy them. The market makers take them up, we sell them. You get short squeezed, you panic, you cover. Everybody wins. It's a win, win, win scenario. Now, if the market goes down and you make money shorting the stocks, congratulations, you win. If you get short squeezed, you lose. That's the risk you take when you short these stocks. And I promise you, I will continue to talk about stocks every single day. I promise you. I promise you. And sometimes they're going to go up. And sometimes they're going to go down. And if you want to call me out every time a stock goes down, then call me out every single day. Because every single day, I promise you, every single day, there will be stocks that will be up and there will be stocks that will be down. I promise you. I promise you. I'm going to speak to you trolls right now, directly, one-on-one, -on -one, okay? Trolls. Listen, it's 2019, it's your boy Rich, you know, um, I know, I know you're trying to short my stocks, it's okay, you can try to short my stocks down, so when they go really, really low, and we do all our research, and we figure out which ones are a buy, and which ones are cheap, we're going to buy them. And then you can cover your short by buying it too. And that's going to create momentum. And that's going to take the stocks right up. Right up. And then we'll be able to sell. And then you might get short squeezed or you might cover your short. And then if they go down again, you can short. When they go up, when they go up, I give you the permission to short them when they're at their 52-week highs, okay? You can short them because I'm going to already be out. I promise you, I will be out. You can short them then. Take them all the way back down again. Take Suniva back down to two bucks. Take T God back down to two bucks. Go ahead. I, I don't own the company. I'm not, I'm not the owner of the company. I just buy the stock. Take it down. Take it down. Once it gets, take Aurora down, take Afria down, use your tactics, right? Put out your news, get your lawyers, right? Right, 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 right. Your tactics, right? Use your tactics, right? Use your tactics. And what we're going to do is we're going to use our tactics because we know your tactics now. We know your game. Your game is old now. We figured out your game. I know your tactics. So I'm not going to tell you my picks, my personal picks. I'm going to keep talking about companies. I'm going to keep working with companies. In fact, we're going to get really big at that. We're going to get really, really big and really powerful doing that. But I'm not going to talk about my picks. You're not going to know what my picks are. You can't hurt me. You can't short me. But when you're wondering what my picks are, just know this. I will own the top 100 cannabis stocks in this sector in 2019. I can share that with you. So go ahead and short all 100 top cannabis stocks in 2019. Go ahead and short those. Because you will know your boy Rich is buying them. Short them down. Down, 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 down. As low as you can go. As low as you can go, because I'm being trained and we're training our gang, our team, the rich gang, the rich TV live community. We're training our team to buy the red. It's true. We're training our team to buy the red. So you guys do your job. We'll do our job. It's win-win. We win. You win. We all win. Win-win.
See how it works? Win-win, man. <laughs> oh, man. I love this game. I love this game. Just love it. Love it. Live for it. Just live for it. So these are the types of stocks that you want to get into. Company like Namaste, everybody wants to hate on them. Everybody wants to trash on them. Everybody wants to say, oh my God, look at Namaste. Oh my God, look at Namaste. What should I do? What should I do? And what I tell everybody, I said, don't panic. I even made a song for you guys. I told you don't panic. If you sold Namaste at 60 cents in Canada, it's at a dollar now. Let's take a look at it. This is the American one. Let's look at the Canadian one. I want to just give you guys some light. I want to share with you guys some light. So we do reggae too. Our boy Ill Kid. Yeah, he dropped this track. This is reggae. I know one guy named was Rebecca. I know one guy named was Rebecca. She got it at flight. Yeah, pull up selector. No, man. Love me some Namaste. That floor was just so tasty. And everyone kept saying, Rich, what's the bottom? What's the bottom? What's the bottom? Well, there's the bottom. It's been identified. It's shown itself now. 76 cents in Canada. What's it going to do tomorrow? I don't know. What do you think it's going to do? What do you think it's going to do? If it was a shitty company, would it have gone up like this today? 30%? Give me the light. Oh, oh. Give me the light. Yo, give me your picks, man. What do you guys want to look at? If you guys want to stay live, smash the like to subscribe. Smash the like. Subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. Every time we have anything breaking, your boy Rich will come live, bring it to you first. Pull up selector. Just give me the light. Just give me the light. Oh. Woo. Yeah, that's a beautiful chart. Selector. Mecca. Just give me the light. Look at that, man. That chart is just a thing of beauty. My goodness. CUV Ventures Corp. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Yo, we got, we got lots of tunes, man. Ill Kid can drop tunes for anything you want. Whatever you want, whatever you want to hear, whatever you ask for, Ill Kid's got a tune for every occasion, man. Yo, let's make that money, man. I'm all about making that money. Let's go. Let's go. Give me your picks, man. I'm going to pull it up on the chart right now. We'll mark it up. We'll mark it up. Ooh, I love you, cannabis stocks. Ooh, you know I love you like I do. Cura, as low as 518, December 4th. Now at $6.86. Been telling you guys, man. Hitting hitting a bottom. They're all doing this with no news, eh? They're all doing this with no news. No news. Yeah. 
Great day for HEXO. Another company coming from the bottom. We're going to mark this. December 24th. Four dollars and twelve cents. Now at five dollars and twenty-one cents, up over a dollar in a week. Gotta hunt these bottoms, man. Give me your picks. Tilt. Tilt has been doing an epic move, but they had a bad day today down 6%, but they've been on a massive run. Massive, massive run. Tilt Holdings Inc. What else? What else should I be looking at? SeaWeb. C-Web up 2% today. And let's look at C-Web. Three-month chart. See these peaks and valleys? You want to be buying here. Here. You want to be buying down here. You want to be buying down here, okay? This is where you want to be buying. And you want to be... I mean, it's so obvious. Like You want to be selling up on days like today. I mean, look at the chart. These are the tops, right? Bottom is under 11. Top is over 15. So if I'm an investor, I'm looking at these bottoms and tops, and I'm like, this is pretty predictable. You guys see the trend here? Like, your eyes don't lie, eh? Look at all the tops and look at the bottoms. This is about buying the bottom, selling the top. Buying the bottom. Selling the top. Having no emotion. Eliminate the emotion, eh? Eliminate the emotion. Look at Kush Bottles. Bottom. Top. Big spread there. You see the spread? Bottom. And what's going to come next? This is going to be a top. And I don't believe we've hit the top. Top is around $6.70. So I still think we have room. Top 1% of traders have zero motion. 100% correct. Concrete. I'm gonna mark all these stocks for you guys, man. Look at Vivo. Just been down, down, down. Coming from a bottom. So these tops are where you want to be selling and these bottoms are where you want to be buying. But if you look at its two year chart, it's been way higher. See that? Vivo is a screaming buy. Screaming buy. So BLPG, you can see here, super sub penny stock, company that's now in the cannabis sector. I talked about them a little bit. They made some moves here, all the way to six cents. Right now, they're all the way down.
to 0023. And they started to get my attention because they came out of nowhere. And I'm like, who are these guys? And they're in the cannabis sector and they're under a penny. And everything in the cannabis sector seems to just run to a penny at least. So I got my eye on these guys. And you can see they've been a little bit lower, as low as 1, 2. That's the bottom. And the top is way, way higher. Just recently at 0034, and obviously much higher at, um, you know, previous to that. So, been as high as 6 cents last year. So, we'll see. I mean, it's a super risky company. I wouldn't suggest anybody buys it, but you never know with these penny stocks, right? They can make you 10 times your money, or you can lose all your money. That's just the way it goes with them. Let's take a look at some of the other picks. USMJ. USMJ, another super sub penny stock. Can't even buy it in Canada. North American Cannabis Holdings, 0013. Wow, look at that momentum. So yeah, there's been a lot of power in this stock, for sure. Lots of power. This is the, let's look at the six month chart. So yeah, they've really been shooting up after being dead. <laughs> they've been dead. Even in the last month, it really shot up. USMJ from 0004 to 0013. So be careful with these. It could all be hype. You want to be careful, right? It could all be hype. So be very, very careful. WMD, yeah, WMD has been on fire. WMD has been on fire. Just crazy. Yeah, WMDC, so I marked this here. So you could see on December 21st, it was at $1.01. Now it's up to $1.40. So it's up 40% in 10 days. So definitely one that you need to watch. They're doing an amazing sneak attack. 40% move is very, very impressive. GRNH. We've been live for over an hour, so if you guys want me to stay live, smash the like button. Give me your picks, or we're going to have to call it a day, peeps. Green Grow Technologies. Been beating up all year, eh? Coming off the bottom. You guys want to see BVO? Yeah, BVO, it was up a little higher today. It finished up even. Love this company, but like look at his chart, you know what I mean? Like it looks like it only has one way to go and that's down. So you have to be careful with BVO, but I love it. <laughs> INSY. I haven't looked into INSY too much detail. I can though. They had a big day today, up 24%. Wow. And they went up after hours too. Look at that power. I N S Y. I like it. N T A R. Yeah, 
Next Tech AR Solutions. Yeah, look at that chart. Look at that chart. Love it. Love this chart. Mark this up. I love to mark the highs and the lows. This is how I trade, guys. I literally just look at the bottom and look at the top. And when it's at the bottom, I'm thinking buying. And when they're at the top, I'm thinking selling. Just no emotion. No emotion needed. No emotion needed. People, I'm going to hold forever. Why? Why? You don't have to. You don't have to. You could be in cash. XLY. What a great way to start 2019, man. I couldn't be happier. What a move for Oxley. Wow. From 62 cents to 90 cents. That's a 50% move in one week. That was a nice, that was the nice trade right there. If you could have got in on that trade, I didn't. I wish I did. That was the trade. Buying the bottom, man. Buy that bottom. Spliff had a day. Thank you for Spliff. Oh, wow. Jeez. From 10 cents to 24 cents. Wow. December 21st. We hit the bottom December 21st. We've been rising since. I like it. I like it. Hey man, when the stocks go down, all that is is a blessing. It's a chance for us to get in cheap. And then when they go up, that's a blessing. It's a chance for us to get out expensive. That's what it is. What do you mean rally coming up? We're already in the rally. You can see it in the charts. That's a 50% move. From 10 cents to 24 cents is a 140% move. This is the rally. We're in the rally. This is the rally, man. I'm telling you. I hope you sold today, man. I sold today. I'm not going to lie. I sold today. And next time it goes red, I'll be buying again. I promise you. <laughs> I'll be buying it again. So, I was just hunting the red. And then when it goes up, I'm just selling like a sniper, man. No hesitation. None. Zero hesitation. Zero. Oh, yeah, man. You guys want to see the difference of this? I'm going to show you guys the difference in the marijuana index. Canadian index up 8.55% today. I want to show you guys a three-year chart. Numbers don't lie, but people do, eh? Remember this. I kept telling you guys, these stocks are not going to just fall off the map. It's a three-year chart. What does that tell you? What does that show you right now? What does it show you? When you look at this chart, what does it show you? When you guys look at this chart, what does it show you? It's the last three years. We've had some, we've had one move to a thousand. We've had a move to 800. We're not even at 500 right now in Canada. We're not even at 500 in Canada. So, I believe 
we can double from here. I believe we're going to hit 1,000 in 2019 at some point, and then we're going to go beyond that because these companies will continue to grow, and the smaller companies will be acquired by the bigger companies. That's what's going to happen. Or the smaller companies will just get bigger. That's what's going to happen. And look at America. So see how America is 95 and see how Canada is at 490? That means Canada is five times the size of America in the cannabis sector. The Canadian market, the Canadian market cap is five times larger than the American market cap, even though America is 10 times larger than Canada. I want you guys to understand this, right? So America at some point is going to pass Canada. So this will be huge. This will be like, like when Canada gets to a thousand, America might be at a thousand, right? They might catch up. So at some point, America's gonna catch up. So this is kind of like a race. And what Canada's doing, because Canada's not as big as America, right? Let's look at the three-year chart in America. Canada's not as big as America. So what Canada's doing to try to stay competitive with America, so you can see the chart there in America has been steadily growing, similar to Canada. What Canada is doing, what the Canadian companies are doing to try to compete with the American companies because they don't have the population is they're trying to internationally distribute and sell cannabis and CBDs first in those countries before the American companies start trying to do that so that they can compete with those American companies because they don't have the population in Canada that Americans do in America. So the American companies have an advantage because they've got 300 million people in their neighborhood. <laughs> Whereas in Canada, we only have 30 million. So we can't compete. That's a fact. We can't compete. So the only way to compete is to grow internationally or to grow in America and build businesses in America and build cannabis incubator companies in America. That's the only way for the Canadian companies to stay ahead of America because to me it's still shocking that Canada has a market cap five times larger than America it's shocking America has 26 companies in this index Canada has 20 companies in this index but yet the Canadian companies market cap is five times larger than the American companies market cap even though the American companies, there's actually more of them in their index than there is in the Canadian index. So I want you guys to see that. There's 20 companies here in the Canadian index, and there's 26 companies in the American index. Do you see this? You see the total volume is 15 million. The Canadian index volume is 56 million. See that? And our market cap, look at this. The 52-week high of the market is 1,133. The 52-week low of the market is at 403. We're currently at 490. So I have a question for you guys. Do you think that we are going to go up or down from here? I just want to know what you guys think because I believe numbers don't lie and charts don't lie, but people do. And I believe that um, we're near the bottom. I really do. Now, I'm not suggesting you should have bought today in the green, but had you bought in the red, congratulations. All right, guys. I think it's time for me to go and say goodbye. Thank you for joining us. I'm just going to remind you once again. Don't panic. Don't panic. We're at the bottom. These companies are only going to make more money. They're only going to get bigger. More and more states in America are going to get legalized. More countries all over the world are going to get legalized. And everything will just get bigger and bigger 
and bigger and bigger. It's true. From me to you, Happy New Year's. I wish you all a glorious 2019 and beyond. If you're not winning, you're not watching. Listen, don't go and buy stuff just because you heard it here first, okay? Rich TV Live is strictly for education and entertainment purposes. Always do your due diligence. Always do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here on Rich TV Live ever, ever, ever. Okay? Seriously. Do your own research before you invest in everything or anything. Tell me, comment on my videos why you bought a stock. If you like a stock. If you want to join my secret groups. And I say groups because I have many of them. Email me, richtvlive at gmail.com. If you want to get all my trending information, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit the bell for notifications. Every single time I just feel like going live, I'm going to go live. It's just the way it's going to be. It is Rich TV Live after all. So I will be going live and pretty soon I'm going to be going live from the beach. Yeah, yeah. I'm getting ready to go on vacation. So I love you guys. If you're not winning, you're not watching. It's true. It's your boy Rich. And I'm out. Peace. Green Day, as predicted, as predicted from your boy, absolutely free, I don't want your money, I want your eyes and ears on the prize, find me the winners, let's go, let's go, let's find the winners, first, first,